Welcome back to Texas Today. It's time to take a look at what's trending on the web. So you may have heard about this. President Donald Trump's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame has been destroyed. Officials say they believe a man with a guitar case walked over to the star, pulled out a pickaxe and started destroying it. There it is. Wow, that's definitely destroyed. Now the man, Austin Clay, turned himself in shortly after this incident. And it just, it gets you thinking, why, you know? What does vandalism prove? You know, he's not the only one, though. I've heard uh, some stuff on social media saying people stomp on it when walking by, spit on it, write things. Uh, but this guy definitely took it far, you know? Well, and this video says it all, right? Because these gentlemen don't have anything to do with the Trump administration, but now it's their job to, to, to clean this up and, and patch it back up, and that, that's tax dollars going to waste. This is the worst form of protest I can imagine. I mean, you know, if you're not a fan of the Trump administration or his policies, that's one thing, but to, to protest by damaging public property is pretty, yeah. pretty juvenile. It yeah. really is. That I mean, is. and then we have to remember the Hollywood Walk of Fame is just filled with, you know, celebrities. And then let's not forget that President Donald Trump was an entrepreneur way before he was a president. You know, very successful one, to say the least. So, yeah, he was a he was a celebrity, I guess, before he mm -hmm. was the president. I think that that star of fame is not because of his presidency. No. It's because of his time on the uh, what's the show that he did? The, the Apprentice. The Apprentice. The Apprentice. That's yeah. Right. yeah. It almost lost me there. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen that. All right, moving on. This is a lighthearted story, and I thought this was so funny when I saw it yesterday. The National Aquarium of New Zealand selects the naughtiest and best behaved penguins every month. Take a look at some of the comments they leave in the notes section. You can see Flip is standing up for a boyfriend. You know, when he's being picked on <laughs> by younger birds, you can see Flip is a strong, independent lady. And then Mo is just outright obnoxious, so he was Naughty Penguin of the Month as well. I saw Mo there. One of the one of the notes for Mo was stealing fish from other penguins' mouths. And That's just obnoxious, Mo. Over. He wouldn't just steal the fish; he'd knock them over. On, I Mo. love Dora. Dora is being demanding. Lulu's friendly. Timmy stole some fish, pushed another penguin over. It was Timmy. It was Timmy. Yeah. Timmy is up to no good. What did Captain get up to? Being he's a good a penguin bully. daddy. Oh, he's a good penguin daddy. Mr. Mac calls out his blind girlfriend so she can find her burrow easily. Oh. Ducks pushed Timmy. Oh, and then Timmy went swimming. I want to meet all these his... penguins. They're on my bucket list now to travel to New Zealand just to see them. This is unbelievable. Hoarding nesting material. I mean, wow. This is so cute. Timmy, Timmy seems to be causing a lot of problems in, yeah. the, in, the, in the penguin yeah. enclosure there. <laughs> well, finally, the Backstreet Boys have a new member of the band. You might recognize him. It's James Corden. Mm -hmm. He took Brian's spot for one song and one song only because he got a little exhausted during this performance in Vegas. Let's take a listen. Look at him doing those dance moves. Oh, it is a dab. He yeah. did dab on stage. It's a quick dab. Yeah. They're rocking their all white outfits there. They're no classic fedoras, all white. Though. I'm a little disappointed. No fedoras. Here's the thing. So after this con after the song ended, James like, thank you. We're the Baxter Boys. Thanks for coming out. And they look at him and say, James, we still got 22 other songs. He said, he I says, quit. Nope. Now, Brian, Brian is not the bad boy, right? Which one's the bad boy? AJ? Is it AJ? Or am I thinking of NSYNC? AJ yeah, is the bad boy. AJ's yeah. the bad boy. No, you got your Baxter Boys right. I don't know which one Brian is. He seems to be replaceable, though. <laughs> hey, Brian, this must be a little tough one for Brian. Brian, can set this one out? Yeah, yeah we, got, we, got, we got a late night team. talk show host to come in for you. <laughs> that looks like a fun Vegas performance. Yeah. Uh, well, the weather is going to feel like Vegas. There's like that right now, Vegas is feeling that humidity. Dry heat, that, yeah. 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 Um, Not as humid as what we have been on Monday. Remember, we had that weak front move through, but all the full details right after this break. And we're listening to a little queen this morning.